Hi guys, I'm Jojo Astro Barbie, Queen of Stars. How are you today? You're wondering why am I wearing glasses? Sexy glasses? Because it's eclipse season. Yes! Anyways, welcome to your weekly horoscope. I'll tell you all about it and how it will affect your sign. And this is Angel. We send you lots of love. Angel, say hello to everybody. Woof woof. We love you, everybody. This week, the sun who is in the sign of Aquarius, beautiful humanitarian Aquarius. So happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Aquarius. We love you. The moon will travel in the signs of Gemini, Cancer and Leo. And on Friday, we have our first full moon lunar eclipse in the sign of Leo, which will be the foreigner of the biggest celestial event in the year 2017 that will occur on August 21st in the total solar eclipse in Leo by then. And it will be seen only all over continental America. And there's a reason for this. It will bring a reversal of the darkness back to the light, the beginning of it. Victories for the righteous and defeat for the people and leaders on the wrong side of history. This week, Eclipse is very lucky though in protecting because it receives a lot of blessings also. The sun and the moon, they receive blessings from Jupiter. Nevertheless, we are in eclipse season, so it always makes us a bit more sensitive, emotional, vulnerable, accident prone. So, vigilance, positive thinking, patience, honesty, diplomacy is the key to wellness, happiness, and success. So, to be sure, make sure to reschedule any elective surgery, try to drive carefully. And don't commit to anything really important or don't sign contracts either, at least for the next week. Okay? It's important. When you are in an eclipse season, you always double check every details in everything you do. And you act slowly, but surely. Another good news this week, Mercury, planet of communication in rigid, conservative, practical, grounded Capricorn will move into a friendlier, more open-minded Aquarius, changing the styles of communication drastically, I assure you. Make it, making it much more exciting, more innovative, uh, bringing unusual thinking patterns and an incredible power of solidarity everywhere. It brings new stories, uh, very much uh, social, some kind of social, expression people are really stepping up to the plate and really fighting for the human rights and it's amazing so are you excited love is in the air what's coming up valentine's day next week on wednesday with a beautiful moon in libra oh my god how perfect is that so i'll tell you more next week and how it will affect your sign and what will cupid give you next week so let me start this week aquarius happy birthday to you Happy birthday to you. The eclipse in your relationship sector bring you more balance between your values and also the things you own. It's like, it, it's like some kind of balance between the invisible and visible part of your life. A better understanding also about the motivations of the friends and your lovers in your life. It really, really makes you understand what do they want from you. In career, it's a very good time to invest in something you believe in. Get rid of the old and get ready for the new. Great things are definitely on the way. Health also getting better. If you have the little issues with your health, you'll see a big improvement this week. And on the weekend, sensual bubble baths, massage therapy, uh, doing yoga, making love. Definitely being close to people you love will do wonders to you. Surrender to love. Get ready for Valentine's Day next week. A Sagittarius, a Capricorn, and a Taurus, and a Cancer show they care. Your magical color pink, lucky numbers 2 and 44. Pisces, the eclipse in your work and health sector make you 
a little sensitive, but also aware of your rights, where you stand in family and domestic matters. You're very determined to make things right, and somehow your legalities work in your favor as long as you're fair. You will get also the answers and the cooperation you need in family matters, in romance and domestic dilemmas need to be treated with fairness. The more fair you are, the more happy you will be in the future. In social life, choose your friends carefully. Pets, animals, music, nature, art also inspire you. And on the weekend, people really show they care. You really experience friendship this week. Your magical color blue, lucky numbers 7 and 28. Aries, the eclipse in your romantic sector bring you hope for your future. You've been sort of an up and down kind of wave, but now it's starting to stabilize. You, because all the Venus and the Mars and your sign gives you that kind of extra edge. And if you're just patient and you believe in miracles, they will occur. You're very lucky in games of chance, so play lottery, participate in contests, you could win something, and listen to the wise advice of a Cancer and a Leo and an Aquarius. They want what is best for you. You can also count on the support of your friends and family. And health issues also, fitness may be on your mind. A good week to get back in shape and to really do your workout, go to the gym, do your daily walk, and be ready because it's a fabulous year ahead waiting for you. And in love, don't go back, move forward. Whatever you've decided on the weekend, something with a special some, someone awaits. ta -da! Your magical color red, lucky like numbers eight and 16. Taurus, the eclipse in your home sector, make you very strong, assertive, sexy, eager to succeed. Your sensitivity and intuition is very, very highlighted. And in career, you possess the ability to get any job done with ease. You're like the master of work this week. The emphasis is on keeping the balance between your personal and professional life and get ready for many rewards and all kind of goodies coming your way. I think it's Valentine's energy, but you will be happy to be you in the next few weeks, even with the eclipses. Believe in your dreams, take initiative, dive into your creativity, and miracles will happen in your life. On the weekend, relax, recharge your batteries. A Pisces, a Cancer, a Virgo, show they care. Your magical color is green. Your lucky numbers, 18 and 36. Gemini's, the eclipses in your communication sector bring a wake-up call in your professional life, especially personal ambitions. You will need to redo things in a different way because you're not getting the success you should have. Don't worry, just readjust your plans. A good time to revise, to redo, and also to take care to make things in a certain way according to what people around you. You know, try to look for teamwork. Uh, love is the answer, not bullies. You are also doing very good with your personal life. You're getting a lot of feedback. And some people could be a little pushy, but you are able to sort of restore the peace in a beautiful way. On the weekend, it's a very good time to take care of business, to have some good negotiation with partners, and also to enjoy life to the fullest. A phone call or a meeting could really make a difference by the end of the week. On the weekend, relax, meditate, and also get together with people you're working on the project with because it will be very good. Your magical color, yellow, lucky numbers, nine and 45. Cancers, the eclipses in your financial sector make you very grounded and brilliant. In career, make your strategies, make your plans, think big and rich. Health also brings answers. It's a very kind of healing week. It's like a miracle is happening in your life. You attract the right doctors, the right therapists, the right products in order to do for you to be the best you could be. It's a great, great year coming through. Your home and family also need special attention. That's okay, you love it. You have also a heart of gold and you play a big role in many people's life. And guess what they're saying? Thank you. On the weekend, generosity and maybe a present will come your way. Your magical color, red, lucky numbers, two and 11. Leo, well, you are the chosen one. The eclipse is in your sign. It's really a fascinating week for you. The eclipse in your sign brings intensity, the ability to make right choices and dealing with shared resources, somehow career positions and 
options and new opportunities come your way. Just be selective, but you are in the power seat now. You solve a domestic situation in a very tactful, innovative way. You're surrounded by a right team. In love, you're very lucky altogether. Single or married, you are able now to attract some very nice, flowy, loving people in your life. You know who you are, you know what you want, and how to get there, so get going. Make sure to meet your loved ones and your partners and your friends and to get together with people you love this week. On the weekend, the metaphysical, the occult inspires you and brings answers. Your magical color is gold, lucky like numbers 3 and 17. Ta-da! Virgo. The eclipses in your spiritual sector bring you wisdom and the courage of your convictions. In career, you work things out perfectly. The focus is also on clarity of mind, high intelligence, and fighting for the good. You are more sensitive than usual in the love department, so take a breather for this. Do it your way, don't make concessions, and be clear about your wishes because the universe is listening now. Be kind and understanding with friends and loved ones on the weekend. Time to pamper and spoil yourself all the way. Your magical color, blue, lucky numbers, 4 and 48. Libra, the eclipses in your social sector bring you exciting ideas for a special project, a good time to reevaluate your situation and to planify in career. In love, you are very popular, but you may feel a little bit sensitive, so surround yourself only with positive, uplifting people and let go of the rest. Helping other people is very rewarding. And the weekend, very good company, music, good food, laughter, and hope is in the air. Enjoy! Remember, you have Jupiter on your sun still until November, so go for it all. You are the luckiest of them all. Your magical color yellow, lucky numbers 2 and 21. Scorpios, the eclipse in your career sector bring a new kind of way of thinking, brilliant ideas, and the amazing determination to get things done. Somehow, time, circumstances, the right people work in your favor. You overcome also a challenge dealing with your health and people are definitely impressed by your performance at home and love everywhere you go. You are also on top of things socially and it's time to believe in yourself, follow your inner feelings and success will be yours. On the weekend, allow yourself to dream in colors. Your magical color fuchsia lucky number 6 and 42. Ta-da! Sagittarius, the eclipse in your karmic sector make you intuitive, spiritual, also sensitive, but very creative. Are you planning maybe to get away somewhere? Sort of do that next month if you can. And if you do, just plan ahead with the details. Go for it all because a change of scenery would do good for you. In career, be the master of your destiny. You know, listen, and then at the end of the day, suggest. You know, some people are right, some people may not see as things as big as you, so make sure you sell and promote yourself. And somehow it's time for you to make the life you want, not what other people want, what you want. On the weekend, feeling the blues could actually inspire you. Listening to the jazz music, blues, will make you even more romantic and ready for next week's Valentine. Your magical color pink, lucky numbers, 4 and 13. ta -da! Capricorn, the eclipse in your shared resources somehow bring you new ideas and an edge that you could really share with other people, especially in career. You're a little, a little bit ahead of the game and it serves you well. You've been working extremely hard lately and within a few weeks, you will be able to take a big bite in the fruits of your amazing labor. You could also receive an encouraging news about a project or at work and try to slow down a little bit and uh, go to the gym, take time for walking, eat good food because you have a lot of things to accomplish this year, right? On the weekend, definitely relax and pamper yourself and say yes to love. Your magical color blue, like in numbers three and nine. And now here's the wizard affirmation of this eclipse week. W. Clement Stone, great, great, great philosopher and author said, whatever the mind of man can conceive, it can manifest. So remember 2017 is a magic wand kind of year. 
a year that you could manifest things very rapidly. So go right ahead and happy Eclipse Weeks. I love you guys. Be good now.